Hi guys. Google has just released its highest quality text-to-image model, Imogen 3 yesterday, and it's currently free to use. In this video, I'm gonna share an easy way to use Imogen 3 for free. Let's get started. We are using Google Labs to try Imogen 3. You can find the official link in the description. Enter ImageFX, and here it says powered by Imogen 3, the latest image model. That's right. You may also chat with Gemini to generate images, but it can only create one image each time, while Google Labs can create for images each time. So this is a better choice. Now you can simply enter your prompt and start creating your own images. It supports various aspect ratio. These are some images I generated with different art styles and aspect ratio. We can see that Imogen 3 performs well in following the prompt as I ask it to put a white AirPods on the girl's ear. Here are more examples I generate and it handles different art styles well, such as photorealistic, anime, 3D, text generation, etc. Besides that, a new editing feature is now available. We can now click on the Edit Image button. Use the brush to paint over the area you like to modify, and enter the prompt to change it, like this. I just remove the logo from the image, though the model is upgraded to the next level. The image resolution is still quite normal, the output resolution is around 1080p, so you have higher demand on image quality. I'd recommend using AI Photo Enhancer like HitPaw PhotoP to enhance the image to 4K, even 8K quality. This is the comparison after enhancing using HitPaw PhotoP. We can tell that the details are well kept and improved greatly. You may also do batch upscaling if you have multiple images to process. So how good is Imogen 3? I also run the same prompts on Midjourney, and next I'll put them side by side to have a comparison between Imogen 3 and Midjourney. Maybe we can discover something. Which one do you like better? Leave your thoughts in the comment and I'd be happy to read them. Hope this video helps, and please don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel for more AI contents and tips. Thanks for watching. See you next time.